friend welcome to my channel the art zone today i have come up with a new video of this runner we have made this runner with two color it's quite simple especially for beginners so let's start the video before starting our video i would request you to please subscribe my channel and hit the bell button do like this video and also give your feedback in comment section so let's start the video for this project we need two color of yarn i have used yellow and off white color we have used 120 grams of white color and we need just 20 to 25 grams of yellow color it is about 27 inches long and 18 inches wide we are going to make this runner with this two color for this project i am using dk lightweight number no. three yarn and i'm using four millimeter crochet hook we need a tapestry needle and a scissor We'll make this runner with the help of this granny square with beautiful flower. I'm using yellow color for flower. You can use any other color. First of all, make a magic ring like this. Now make three chains. One, two, three. These chains will be covered as a double crochet. After making three chains, make two more chains for chain space. Insert the hook into this ring and make a double crochet. Two chains. Again, insert the hook into the ring and make a double crochet. Two chains. Insert the hook into the ring. Make third double crochet sorry four double crochet with this pattern we will make eight double crochet two chains double crochet two chains double crochet one two three four five six and you'll make two more double crochet two chains double crochet two chains and double crochet with this pattern you will make eight double crochet one two three four five six seven and eight after making a double crochet pull the yarn and close the ring then make last two chains one two insert the hook into third chain one two three and make a slip stitch like this a double crochet two chains for next round insert the hook into this chain space and make a slip stitch now make three chains one two three this chain will be counted as a double crochet now we'll make four incomplete double crochet insert the hook into the chain space and pull through these two loops again insert the hook into chain space and now pull through these two loops now we have three loops on crochet hook again with this pattern we'll make four incomplete double crochet one two three and next four these three chains and next four half incomplete double crochet will be make a cluster of five double crochets now insert the hook like this make four chains one two three four repeat the pattern insert the hook into next chain space now we'll make five incomplete double crochet insert the hook and pull through these two loops now we have two loops on crochet hook one two three 
four, five. With this pattern, we'll make one, two, three, four, five incomplete double crochet. Next, we have this six loops on crochet hook to pull the yarn through all the six loops together and make four chains one two three four repeat the pattern insert the hook into next chain space and make one incomplete double crochet two three four and five after making five double crochet we should have six loops on crochet hook one two three four five six so pull the yarn through all the six loops together with this pattern we'll make a cluster now make four chains one two three four and with the same pattern we'll make next one two three four five five cluster one two three four and five after making five incomplete double crochet pull the yarn through all the loops together then make four chains one two three four and next five incomplete double crochet one four after making four chains now make a cluster of five incomplete double crochet into the next chain space one two three four Five. And pull the yarn through all the six loop together with this pattern we'll make next two cluster after making last cluster make four chains one two three four and insert the hook into the first chain make a single crochet then here is the joining chain insert the hook into this chain and make one more slip stitch then cut the yarn with this pattern you will make the flower like this here is the extra yarn Now flip the flower You can see this we have completed the inner flower now we'll take the next color I'm using this off white color first of all make a slip knot like this now insert the hook into the chain space you can take any chain space And make a single crochet then make two chain this single crochet and two chain will be counted as a double crochet into same chain space make two more double crochet one two with this pattern it will make three double crochet two chains and make three more double crochet into same chain space with this pattern we we'll make our first corner one 
टू एंड थ्री लेट मी थ्री डबल क्रोशे टू चेन्स एंड थ्री डबल क्रोशे नाउ मेक अ चेन एंड जम्प टू वर्ड द नेक्स्ट चेन स्पेस एंड सूट द हुक इन टू नेक्स्ट चेन स्पेस एंड जस्ट मेक थ्री डबल क्रोशे वन टू एंड थ्री यू कैन सी दिस इन फर्स्ट चेन स्पेस वी मेड थ्री डबल क्रोशे टू चेन एंड थ्री डबल क्रोशे दैन मेक अ चेन इन टू नेक्स्ट चेन स्पेस यू विल मेक जस्ट थ्री डबल क्रोशे दैन मेक अ चेन एंड जम्प टूअर द थर्ड चेन स्पेस एंड मेक सेकेंड कॉर्नर विथ थ्री डबल क्रोशे वन Two, three, two chains, and three more double crochet into the same chain space. One, two, and three. Like this, we made first round. Next, make a chain. In second chain space, make three double crochet. One, two, three. Then make a chain. And next chain space again. Repeat the pattern. Make three double crochet, two chains, and three double crochet. One, two, and three. Make the chain and jump toward the next chain space and make three double crochet. One, two, three. Make a chain. Into next chain space, make three double crochet, two chains, and three double crochet. One, two, three double crochet. Then make two chains and three more double crochet into same chain space. One, two, three. Like this. Then make a chain, and here is the last chain space. So into this ch last chain space, make three double crochet. One, two, three. Make a chain, and now insert the hook into second chain, and make a slip stitch. With this pattern, you will complete first round. For second round, insert the hook into next chain. Make a slip stitch. Next chain, slip stitch. Then here is the chain space. So insert the hook into chain space and make a slip stitch. Now make three chains: one, two, three. And with this pattern, you'll make second round. So insert the hook into same chain and make two. More double crochet with this pattern. You'll make three double crochet because you'll count these three chains as double crochet. After making three double crochet, repeat the pattern. Make two chains and three more double crochet into same chain space. With this pattern, you'll make the corner. Three. Then make a chain, and next we have chain space. So into this chain space, we'll just make three double crochet: one, two, three. Now make a chain, and you can see this. Here we have the next chain space. So into this chain space, we'll make three double crochet: one, two. 
three. Next we have the corner. So make a chain, insert the hook into next chain space and make three double crochet, two chains and three double crochet. One, two, three, two chains and three double crochet. One, two, three. Then next, make a chain into next chain space, make three double crochet. One, two, three. One chain and next chain space, three double crochet. One, two, three. Next we have the corner. So make a chain, insert the hook into the corners chain space and make three double crochet, two chains and three double crochet. One, two, three. Then make two chains and three more double crochet into same chain space. One, two, three. Just keep doing with this pattern. Make a chain into next chain space. Make three double crochet. Make a chain next three double crochet. Make a chain into the corner chain space. Make three double crochet, two chains and three double crochet like this. Then make a chain, three double crochet, chain, three double crochet, and make a chain and join with this slip stitch. With this pattern, we'll complete this square. last double crochet after making last three double crochet then make a chain and insert the hook into third chain and join with a slip stitch like this with this pattern we'll make a granny square now we'll hide the extra yarn from back side The same pattern we'll make second square like this and when we will reach to the third corner first of all we'll make first corner then second and here's third corner so after making last three double crochet make a chain and now insert the hook into the corners chain space and make three double crochet one two Three. After making four three double crochet, now we'll join them together. Here's our first square. Now flip the square like this. After making three double crochet, insert the hook from back side and make a slip stitch. After making a slip stitch, make a chain. Now make next three double crochet. One, two, three. With this pattern, you can see this. We have joined the corners. After making two double crochet, again insert the hook from back side you can see this this back side insert the hook from back side and make a slip stitch then make a chain and jump toward the next chain space and make three double crochet one two three then next chain space, insert the hook, make a slip stitch and a chain. Then next chain space, make three double crochet. 
वन टू थ्री देन इंसर्ट द हुक इन टू नेक्स्ट चेन स्पेस मेक ए स्लिप स्टिच देन मेक ए चेन एंड नाउ हेर वी हैव द कॉर्नर सो इंसर्ट द हुक इन टू कॉर्नर मेक फर्स्ट थ्री डबल क्रोशी वन टू थ्री आफ्टर मेकिंग थ्री डबल क्रोशी ऑफ द कॉर्नर नाउ इंसर्ट द हुक इन टू नेक्स्ट कॉर्नर एंड मेक ए स्लिप स्टिच एंड अ चेन देन मेक remaining three double crochet one two three with this pattern we'll join them now complete the pattern make a chain next three double crochet one Two, three. Make a chain and last three double crochet. After making last three double crochet, then make a chain and join with the slip stitch. Insert the hook into third chain and make a slip stitch. With this pattern, we have joined these squares. with the same pattern we'll join third square after making three double crochet of third corner insert the hook into corner chain space make a slip stitch then make a chain and next three double crochet into same chain space then insert the hook into next chain space make a slip stitch a sing a chain and three double crochet one two three as you can see this insert the hook into next chain space make a slip stitch then make a chain and Three double crochet. One, two, three, like this. The same pattern. We'll join them together. After making last three double crochet, then make a chain and join with the slip stitch. Insert the hook into third chain. For this pattern, we have joined these squares. After joining them, for next round, insert the hook into next chain, make a slip stitch. Then insert the hook into next chain, make a slip stitch. And next, we have the chain space. Insert the hook into this chain space, make a slip stitch, and three chains. One, two, three. Two more double crochet. One, two, two chains, and three more double crochet into same chain space with this pattern. We'll make the corner. Two, three. After making first corner, next we have one, two, and three chain spaces. So we'll repeat the pattern. Make a chain. and three double crochet in each chain space 1 2 3 make a chain next chain three double crochet make a chain next three double crochet 2 and Three. After making three double crochet, make a chain, and here we have the next 
corner so insert the hook into this corner and make three double crochet two chains and three double crochet one two three then make two chains and three double crochet You can see this. Next, we have these three chain spaces one, two, three, and we'll count the corners chain space four, and then next corner space to make a chain. Insert the hook into next chain space, make three double crochet one, two, three, make a chain, next three double crochet. make a chain next three double crochet one two three then make a chain and here we have the next chain space insert the hook into this chain space and make three double crochet one two After making the double crochet, make a chain, and here we have the second corner. To insert the hook into this chain space and make three double crochet. One, two, and three, like this. Three double crochet into first corner, then make a chain and three double crochet into second corner then repeat the pattern make a chain and three double crochet into ch each chain space after making three double crochet make a chain and here we have the next corner we we'll make three double crochet into this chain space then make a chain and three double crochet into next chain space like this then make a chain and make three double crochet into next chain space make a chain three double crochet make a chain three double crochet into the corner again we'll repeat this pattern make three double crochet two chains and three double crochet into the next corner then make three double crochet three double crochet three double crochet and make next corner with three double crochet two chains and three double crochet and repeat the pattern all around and join with the slip stitch then again make three slip stitches and insert the hook into this chain space then make a new corner with three double crochet two chain three double crochet with this pattern you will make three more round with same pattern and then i will tell you that what we have to do next you can see this we have completed next three round with this pattern we have made one two three four five six seven rounds after completing seven rounds now I'll cut the yarn from here. Okay, after cutting the yarn into same chain, insert the hook and take the next color. Then make three chains. One, two, Three. This chain will be counted as the first double crochet into next chain we double crochet in next chain double crochet this pattern will make three double crochet one two three after making three double crochet Next we have the chain space, insert the hook into chain space and make two double crochet. One, two. In this round we will make two double crochet into chain space. Then make two chains and two more double crochet. One, two. Then next we have this three double crochet, so we'll make one double crochet in each chain. One, two, 
two and three like this first of all you make three double crochet then to chain space make two double crochet two chains and two double crochet then again make three double crochet next we have the chain space so we'll make one double crochet into this chain space in this round we'll just make one double crochet in each chain including these chain spaces then next we have three double crochets we'll make one double crochet into each of the next double crochet one next one double crochet next one double crochet then again we have the next chain space we'll make one double crochet into the chain space and then make next three double crochet make one double crochet into each chain one next one double crochet next one double crochet again we have next chain space so insert the hook into this chain space and make a double crochet then next three double crochet just keep doing this pattern make one double crochet into each chain after making one double crochet into each chain next we have the corners so we'll make one double crochet into each of the next three double crochet one two three then we have the chain space of the next corner so we'll make two double crochet two chains and two double crochet one two Two chains and two double crochet. One, two. The next three double crochet. Make one double crochet into each of the next chain. Crochet. And one double crochet into chain space. Then make three double crochet into next chain and one double crochet like this with this pattern. We'll complete this round. After making one double crochet in each chain. Here we have the last chain space to so insert the hook into last chain space and make a double crochet insert the hook into third chain and join them together with a slip stitch and cut the yarn from it for next round again we will take white color After making a slip stitch, insert the hook into next corner. Make a single crochet. Then make two chains. One, two. This single crochet and next two chain will be counted as our first double crochet. Insert the hook into same chain space and make two more double crochet. One. Two. This pattern will make three double crochet. Then make two chains one, two, and make three more double crochet into same chain space. After making two double crochet two chains and three double crochet you can see this here we have next two double crochet into chain space so make a chain and skip this two double crochet one two insert the hook into third chain and make a double crochet next chain double crochet next chain double crochet like this we'll skip this two double crochet then make a chain and make one double crochet next chain one double crochet next chain one double crochet here we have double crochet of chain space for this we'll make a chain and skip this double crochet insert the hook into second chain 
and next make three double crochet one one into next chain and one into next chain like this again we have the double crochet which we have made on chain space so we'll skip this double crochet make a chain skip this double crochet insert the hook into top chain of next double crochet and make a double crochet next double crochet next double crochet Just keep doing this pattern make three double crochet in top chain of next three double crochet then skip this double crochet which we have made on chain space then make a chain skip this double crochet and make next three double crochet again repeat this pattern Okay, after making last three double crochet again we have the double crochet of chain space for this make a chain and skip this two double crochet and jump toward the next chain space and make the corner with three double crochet two chains and three double crochet one two three then make two chains and three more double crochet into same chain space with this pattern we'll make the next corner after making the corner next we have this two double crochet so we'll skip this two double crochet make a chain and jump towards the next top chain of third double crochet and make one double crochet next one double crochet next one double crochet after making this two double crochet then repeat the pattern make a chain skip double crochet and insert the hook into next chain and then make three double crochet one two three keep doing with this pattern just make three double crochet skip next chain make a chain and next three double crochet then we will reach to the next corner we have to make three double crochet two chains and three double crochet with this pattern we will complete this round we have completed this round you can see this we have made last three double crochet next we have this two double crochet of corner chain space so we'll make a chain insert the hook into second chain and join with the slip stitch like this with same point we'll start new round make three chains one two three this chain will be counted as our first double crochet now insert the hook into top chain of second double crochet and make a double crochet next double crochet after making three double crochet here we have the chain space you can see this so into this chain space we make two double crochet one Two. After making two double crochet, make two chains and two more double crochet into same chain space. With this pattern, we'll increase the corners. Then next we have this three double crochet, so we'll make one double crochet into each of the next chain. His first chain, insert the hook into this chain, make a double crochet. Next double crochet 
next double crochet you can see that in this round you'll make one two three three double crochet and then make two more double crochet five double crochet two chains in five double crochet with this pattern we'll make each corner after making five double crochet make a chain skip chain space insert the hook into top chain of next double crochet and make a double crochet into first chain double crochet into second chain and double crochet into third chain after making three double crochet again we have the next chain space so make a chain and skip chain space insert the hook into top chain of next double crochet then repeat the pattern one double crochet into first chain one double crochet into second chain and one double crochet into third chain like this just make one double crochet into each chain after making two double crochet make a chain and jump toward the next chain of double crochet skip chain space make a chain and insert the hook into next chain make a double crochet double crochet double crochet next pat pattern is quite simple after making last two double crochet then make a chain and next we have the corner insert the skip chain space insert the hook into top chain of next double crochet and make a double crochet one next two next three after making three double crochet here we have chain space, so we'll make two double crochet, two chains in, two double crochet into this chain space. One, two. Then next we have this three double crochet, so we'll make one double crochet into each chain. And make three double crochet, one, next, two, and next, three. Then here we have the chain space so make a chain and jump toward the next chain and make three double crochet one next chain two and next chain three keep doing with this pattern and complete this round we have completed round two you can see this we are at the end of round two after making last three double crochet make a chain and insert the hook into third chain and join them together with a slip stitch and finish the round two for next round from same same chain make three more chains one two three this chain will be counted as a first double crochet and now we'll make one two three four four more double crochet make one double crochet into each chain With this pattern you will make one two three four five double crochet and next we have the chain space so we'll repeat the pattern make two double crochet two chains and two double crochet into the chain space one two then make two chains and two more double crochet into same chain space one two In this round, we'll again increase two double crochet into chain space. With this pattern, we'll make one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Then in next round, we'll make nine, eleven, thirteen, fifteen, seventeen. With this pattern, we'll increase the corner. And next, make one double crochet into each chain. One. Two, three, four, five. You can see this. We made five, seven double crochet, two chains, and seven double crochet. 
we'll just repeat this pattern in each round make one double crochet into each of next double crochet then into chain space we'll make two double crochet two chains in two double crochet then next make a chain and make one double crochet into each of the next chain one two three like this then make a chain just repeat the pattern One, two, three. Make a chain. Next, three double crochet. One, two, three. Make a chain. And next, three double crochet. One into first chain. One into second chain. And one into third chain. This pattern will remain quite same. Just make three double crochet, one chain in each round. With this pattern, we will make seven round. One, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven. Make four more round with same pattern. Just increase two chain, two double crochet, two chains and two double crochet in each chain space. Then make a chain and three double crochet in each row with this pattern. We'll make this runner. Okay, we have completed seven rounds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. After making last chain, insert the hook into third chain and join with a slip stitch. With this pattern, we'll complete our second last round and cut the yarn from here. Now we are going to make our border with yellow color. Insert the hook into this chain space and take yellow color. Like this. Now insert the hook into chain space and make three chains one, two, Three. This chain will be counted as double crochet. Make two more double crochet into same chain space. One, two. With this pattern, make three double crochet. Now skip. One, two, three. Three double crochet. Insert the hook into fourth chain. Here is four double crochet. Insert the hook into top chain of four double crochet and make a single crochet then again make three chains one two three and two more double crochet into same chain space one two then next one two three skip these three chains insert the hook into top chain of four double crochet and make a single crochet then make three chains one two three make two more double crochet into same chain one two after making three double crochet next skip one two three chains insert the hook into fourth chain and make a single crochet and from the same place make three chains one two three two more double crochet into this chain chain one two then next we have these three double crochets so we'll skip one two three three chain and here we have the chain space so insert the hook into this chain space and make a single crochet repeat the pattern three chains and two double crochet one two three 
2 then next skip 3 double crochet 1 2 3 insert the hook into top chain of 4th double crochet and make a single crochet with this pattern we'll make the corner and next make 3 chains 1 2 3 2 more double crochet just keep doing with this pattern make 3 double crochet skip next 3 chains 1 2 3 insert the hook into 4th chain and make a single crochet then make 3 chains 1 2 3 and into same chain make 2 double crochet 1 2 skip 1 2 3 chains insert the hook into 4th chain and make a single crochet you can see this this pattern will make final round two double crochet one and two then next skip one two three three chains and here we have the chain space so insert the hook into this chain space make a single crochet three chains two double crochet one two then next skip this three double crochet insert the hook into next chain space make a single crochet three chains and two more double crochet into same chain space one two then repeat the pattern skip next group of double crochet insert the hook into next chain space make a single crochet three chains two double crochet one two then jump toward the next chain space skip this three double crochet and make a single crochet three chains two more double crochet one Two. then make a single crochet into next chain space you can see this with this pattern we'll make this three double crochet in each chain space After making 3 double crochet into last chain space, next you can see this, here we have the corner. So in skip 1, 2, 3, these 3 chains, insert the hook into 4th chain and make a single crochet, then make 3 chains and make 2 more double crochet into same chain, 1, 2, then skip next three chains insert the hook into fourth chain and make a single crochet three chains two more double crochet into same chain one two and skip next one two three chains insert the hook into fourth chain make a single crochet then make three chains make two more double crochet into same chain one two then skip last three double crochet and jump toward the next chain space and make a single crochet three chains two more double crochet one two then skip next three double crochet one two three insert the hook into fourth chain make a single crochet three chains two double crochet one two then skip next three chains insert the hook into fourth chain make a single crochet just keep doing with this pattern and complete the final round
Okay, we have completed our final round. When we will read to the last double crochet. After making last three double crochet, now you can insert the hook into first chain and make a slip stitch. From this point, we will cut the yarn and finish our project. With this pattern, we have completed our runner, as you can see this. Okay friend, I hope you will like this project and we'll meet you soon with a new video. Till then, goodbye.